Hi, I'm Dr. William Curtis. I'm the Medical Director of Future Focus Family Medicine and I'm one of the authors and uh, contributors to the Energy Tribe blog. Um, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about nutritional supplements today. I get a lot of questions about this in my day-to-day -day medical practice. Uh, I use them medicinally. Some people say vitamins, minerals, is that something we need every day? Yes, I believe a lot of people are very deficient in these things. But there's an approach that I like to take that's, uh, I like to have a balanced approach that basically is, a, is an archway of health. And there's, there's key components to this that gives a structure. Uh, I think sometimes people get the idea that, well, I heard cinnamon is good for me. So they start taking a cinnamon supplement. Or maybe they say, I heard uh, taking magnesium is good for me. So they take that. And then they end up with this big giant pile of vitamins, minerals, and supplements that may or may not be beneficial for them for their specific medical problems. What I like to do is organize those. And so when I see a patient with focal problems, I'll actually give them this kind of an organized approach to what should work best for them. Um, in particular, at the very top of what we call our um, archway of health, our energy archway, is the blood sugar control uh, keystone, if you will. That keystone, if you're not focusing on what you do for blood sugar control, you're really going to struggle in, in health for many different reasons. Blood sugar control is really important. If you've got symptoms of sluggishness, food cravings, irritability, uh, if you feel like you can't sleep well, like you have insomnia, you're overweight, uh, intense hunger, these are symptoms that you're struggling with handling sugar. And I've heard a lot of patients um, mention, well, you know, when I have my Mountain Dew, I, my shakiness goes away. because I mean, It's the Mountain Dew that's triggering that, typically. So, um, as we get into this, the biggest important thing before we talk about supplements is that you need to limit simple sugars, especially processed sugars. These would be sodas, beers, alcohol, uh, things you might open out of a package, chips, candy bars. These are all things that are very intense bursts of sugar that your body has to deal with. And this is a complex interaction between your liver, your pancreas, uh, it involves your insulin levels. All of these things get out of balance, out of whack, hyper-responsive, which leads you to feel bad. That's where these symptoms come from. <clears throat> if you talk about supplementation, if you're doing all those nutritional things we just talked about, you're avoiding simple sugars, you're, you're, you're keeping those really low in your diet. What you can look at is there's a few supplements that just anybody can take. They're very safe. Let me describe those. The first one is one called AF Beta Food. It's made by Standard Process. Standard Process is a whole food supplement company that has been around for years. Uh, they make completely organic uh, products. I always like to tell patients that they're so organic you can eat off the tires of the trucks that deliver them. I, that sounds like an exaggeration, but the reality is that they really they go overboard trying to make sure they're providing you a product that's void of chemicals, pesticides, and, and various things that we have to deal with in, in, uh, um, in our food uh, supply. AF Beta Food is made from red beets. Um, and it has a specific ingredient in it called betaine. Betaine thins bile salt. Bile is made in the liver. It helps us with our digestion. It helps us with cholesterol management um, and absorption of our fats and uh, other nutrients when we eat. Many people that have high carbohydrate diets, i.e. diabetics, people overweight, often um, have very sluggish bile salt. And that's why they tend to get gallstones, have their gallbladder taken out, things like that. AF beta food thins those bile salts. It helps stabilize sugar handling. It doesn't necessarily replace medicines for a diabetic, but it can improve how your liver behaves, uh, how your uh, 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 food and minerals are absorbed, and it certainly um, it can improve a lot of di uh, digestive woes that pa patients complain of. So it's a great uh, source to take. It can be taken in large, large doses depending on the reason uh, that we're giving it. But in, for most people, just for, you know, for liver detoxification, for thinning bile salts, for helping with sugar handling, I like to give maybe three to six of those twice a day. Remember, it's food. So you can blend it up. You can any which way you can get it in, three to six of those twice a day. I usually tell t people to take those for three to four months and then taper off of them. Um, if they're doing really well while they're on them, they can maintain a dose of maybe two twice a day. The other thing that you could try if you have really intense food cravings, sugar cravings, is a product also made by MediHerb, which is a sister company to Standard Process. It's called Gymnema. Gymnema is an herbal supplement that tends to help with sugar handling. Uh, again, it works at the level of the liver in many cases. And also, it uh, tends to really help people that have very intense cravings for sugar. I've told people they can allow this to dissolve on their tongue, and it tends to change the flavor of sugar, or you can just swallow it because certainly it may not taste, you may not like the flavor of it. 
when you take this, uh, take it when you feel like you have, you just got to have that candy bar, you got to have that soda, that's a good time to take one or two gymnema. You can take up to a couple of those twice a day. That's, that's, you can take more, but that's typically what most patients um, benefit from. So again, as a summary, we're talking about blood sugar uh, control, and that's the key stone in, a, in an archway of health. It gives you a little structure to how we use nutritional supplements uh, on the energy plan. If you're, not doing, if you're not doing your dietary changes, if you're not watching out for processed sugars in your diet, you're going to continue to struggle with obesity, um, irritability, food cravings, uh, sluggishness, mental fogginess, all of these kind of things that uh, are really common complaints. If you'll eliminate those things and consider things like AF beta food, gymnema, and the doses that I described, I think you'll, you'll feel quite a bit better. Thanks.